hi welcome back to one more video tutorial if you are new to this channel you can subscribe my channel for more updates go to toolbar and select this ellipse now press and hold alt key and make a circle now duplicate this circle by pressing alt key on your keyboard Now go to toolbar and select the scissor tool. Cut the line here. Go to toolbar and select type on a part tool and click over the curve and write the text of the logo. Now click on align right. Take this line to the end of the curve. Now click on align center. Go to type option. Type on a path. Type on a path option. And make it center. Preview. Okay. Now increase the size of the text. Select the text and click on right mouse button and create outlines. And unite it. Now select the text, go to edit, copy, edit, paste in back. Now use arrow key on your keyboard and take this new uh, copy text to the downward. Now change the color of this new text. Now click on upper text and increase the stroke. Change the stroke color to white. Reduce the stroke size. Now select the text and expand it. Change the color. Go to toolbar and select ellipse. Take scissor tool. Now go to brush library and select a brush. Select this and close it. Now select this curve and click on the brush. Now expand the brush. Now increase the size little bit. Draw a curve. Now go to toolbar and select type on a path tool and click over the curve and write the slogan of the logo. Now click on align right. Take this line to the end of the curve. Now align center. Go to type. Type on a path. Type on a path option. Center. Preview. Okay. Now increase the size of the text. Now let me change the font. Go to object, expand it, 
and unite it. Now change the color. Double click here and change the color. Select this circle, go to edit, copy, edit, paste in place. Take this circle to the downward and make it smaller. Now duplicate this inner circle, go to edit, copy, edit, paste in place. Now draw another ellipse. Now rotate it a little bit. Now select it. Go to Shape Builder tool and uh, change the color and click here. Now select the circle and increase the thickness. Now select the upper circle. Go to edit, copy, edit, paste in place. Now select the middle circle, go to scissor tool and cut here. Now go to toolbar and select type on a path tool and click over the curve and write the text. Now click on align right. and bring it to the other end of the curve and now click on center go to type option type on a path type on a path option and make it on the center preview okay now you can increase the size now increase the size of the outer circle as well object expand it okay now select this circle go to tool option and select eraser tool and erase it here erase it here here as well and here also Now double click over this line and delete it. Change the color. Now bring the text to the front, arrange and bring to front. Now let's draw some bubbles inside it. For that go to brush library and go to decorative and decorative scatters. Here you can see uh, bubbles are available. Click over it. So here you can see the bubble option came here. Now take a pen and draw a curve. And select this bubble brush. Now increase the stroke. Expand it. Now 
now send it to back double click over it Now change the font of the text. Change the color. Now go to tool option and select rectangle. Change the color. Now go to tool option and select this ellipse. Now press and hold alt key and draw a circle. Now select both and take it here, make the size smaller. Rotate it and put it here. Double click here and change the color so this way you can make this logo hope you have learned how to make this thank you for watching